truly wish I was with you all today in person. There is no greater privilege than watching a group of new graduates at the end of many years of hard work. And to be there watching from the stage, feeling the pride of your family and your friends and professors would have undoubtedly been the highlight of my year. I'm grateful still to get a few minutes to share some words with you celebrating your tremendous achievement. While so much of what is happening is tragic and disheartening in so many cases, I look at you with a lot of optimism and a lot of envy. What has inspired me over the past 11 weeks is our country's resilience, our adaptability, our ingenuity. This has been demonstrated over and over in the kick-ass innovative pivots of many companies and people who overnight have changed their business models to deliver protective equipment and other life-saving products. Many of these people have backgrounds like you in computer science and engineering. They are the problem solvers and the solution builders that society is depending on to get us through this challenging time. You're graduating and entering the workforce at a pivotal time in the history of humanity. Our lives will be divided into pre-COVID times and post-COVID times. And more than ever, ever before, the world needs you, the engineers, the computer scientists, the thinkers, the doers. And you are going to help us reboot, to reframe, to build new and better structures, not just the traditional engineering structures, but societal structures. You will have an enormous amount of opportunity to better our world. And I have faith that you will do that with the most brilliant of engineering minds. You have already demonstrated that you are resilient and you are capable. My challenge, my call to action for you, the designers of our post-pandemic world, is to do this rebuild on a different foundation from what we had before. On a foundation of anti-racism, of equality for women, honoring and incorporating the incredible indigenous knowledge and voice of our country, and building in diverse perspectives at every opportunity. Your unapologetic, unwavering commitment to equality must be built into every structure, every bridge, every city, every research project, every computer program. This reboot is an opportunity for us, for you, to do things differently. I might not be face to face with you right now, but I can see you. I see your potential and today I honor it. Congratulations to each of you.